One of the things that is the most rewarding and satisfying about foraging is the way it really gives you much more of an intense relationship with nature. Tama Matsuoka is a, an attorney and a banker who lived for many, many years in Hong Kong. And she moved out to the Wikichioki Creek, where we have our Wikichioki Creek Preserve. And she became a friend of the New Jersey Conservation Foundation and a donor. And she got interested in plants. And she completely transformed her lawn around her home, which is right at the Wikichioki, into a native wildflower meadow. And then she took it a step further. And she started looking back into her own Asian roots and her own grandmother, who used to forage. My relatives who are from Japan or China recognize some of the plants that were growing and that were so-called invasive plants. How can you, you know, remove invasive plant species from nature preserves and use them for cooking? I'm Mark Drabik from Metropolitan Seafood and uh, I'm here with my friend Tama today. We're going to make a salad and we're going to take a traditional recipe that I've done many times before and through these beautiful lands from New Jersey Conservation, we're gonna be switching out some ingredients that grow wild around here. Okay, this is lesser celandine. The things that I'm working with New Jersey Conservation on is controlling some of these invasive plants. And one of the ways that we can control them is by eating them. The dish that we're making today is a smoked trout. It comes from the musky trout hatchery in Asbury, New Jersey. This is a lebni, which is like a Greek style yogurt. Wild onion. A white wine vinegar. And we need a little bit of olive oil and we're gonna put a little horseradish in there. And this is gonna be the base of our dressing. You have gotten me these greens, the lesser salad, I have some dandelion here to go into this. This is perfect. So we're gonna set this right here. That's our little forage salad. And we're gonna take some nice big chunks of our smoked fish. Where's that sumac? Okay, so this is sumac from New Jersey. The color is gorgeous. And it's not poison sumac. And then we're gonna take a little of our pine needles to garnish this. I want you to taste this because it's all about the perfect bite. Okay, ready? Right. Mmm. Wow, that's really great. The bitiness of the green against the trout is strong. That's really great. Mm. We're not lying. <laughs> this is actually good. <laughs> sometimes, I'm, I'm, sometimes I've lied. <laughs> this time I'm telling the truth. This is actually very, very good. Thank you so much for having okay, me in the house. Yay. Thank you very much. Thanks for coming. <laughs>